Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to look at the Lewis structure for CH2F2 which is also known as difluoromethane. And to determine its Lewis structure, we are first going to look at the total number of valence electrons. So here we have one atom of carbon, two atoms of hydrogen and two atoms of fluorine. So carbon has four valence electrons, each hydrogen atom will have one valence electron and each fluorine atom has seven valence electrons. And in total we get 20 valence electrons for CH2F2. Now here carbon is the least electronegative atom over here, so we will place carbon in the center. Hydrogen atoms and fluorine atoms will be arranged around it like this. Now to show the bonds, we are going to place a pair of electrons between hydrogen and carbon atom, fluorine and carbon atom. So this way we are using 8 valence electrons out of 20. The rest of the electrons will be arranged around all the atoms to check if the octets are complete. So here we have 10, 12, 14. 16, 18, 20. Doing that, we have used up all 20 valence electrons and now let's see if the octets are complete. So fluorine atom here has 8 valence electrons after sharing one electron with carbon. Hydrogen atom has 2 valence electrons in its outer shell and it has attained a stable structure. And carbon atom as it is sharing 4 valence electrons with 4 atoms has a complete octet. So as all the atoms have complete octet, this is the lowest structure for difluoromethane. And I hope this video helps you to understand that easily. For more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.